these are two fans which we have both are rexnord make one is ball bearing and one is sleeve bearing this is 22038a to t this means this is a fan which is having sleeve bearing and with terminal second one we have is rexnord 22038b to t that is means it's a ball bearing fan both are 220 volt ac and both are 0.10 ampere with the 50 hertz so start see first point which we have to consider is noise those fans which we are using you are using in panel or in your chimney or wherever you are using as a industrial product they are running continuously so this sleeve bearing fans are running fast as compared to ball bearing they are having high rpm so they are making extra noise as compared to ball bearing because ball bearing fans depend on your size which you are taking them your which you are buying is depend as per your requirement so higher the rpm higher the noise and you will get higher rpm fan in sleeve bearing only ball bearing fans are not that much high speed so this is the fan which is 4 inches only but this is making little bit extra noise than ball bearing because ball bearing having little rpm low rpm we will go for ball bearing first this is a ball bearing fan we are going to give power to his connector and see the noise This was ball bearing fan. Now we will connect our sleeve bearing fan. This is a sleeve bearing fan. So friends, now you have most all you have checked the noise of both fans. You are going to buy them. Check the noise of your fan as per your size of fan. The bigger the size, bigger the noise. For ball bearing, if you are using them in office, if you are using them in factory where the noise is more and you are using them on the rooftop, you can use high noise, but they will exhaust most of your inside air to outside with high rpm now we are going to speak on next point that is life of bearing so ball bearings and sleeve bearings both are having a life as per maker so mostly the makers are giving ball bearing life is from 35000 to 50,000 hours in their life of ball bearing and the sleeve bearing mostly are with the maximum life of 20, 25,000 hours to our next point that is lubrication so if you 
are using sleeve bearing pan a big size pan we are not speaking about small pans small pans you cannot lubricate them so this is the sleeve bearing pan sleeve bearing pan are having limited lubricant in their shells so as bore bearing also having limited but they can be refilled not the small fan but if you going for a big fan you can open their panel and you can lubricate them but the sleeve bearing fan fan you can you cannot open their housing or their panel to lubricate it but on other side ball bearing fan big size fan you can open their uh, panel you can use uh, refill refill their uh, lub lubricant in it and they will run max to your their life they are giving 50000 or um, the last point which we are going to discuss is price it is a main aspect see price of sleeve bearing fan is little bit lower than ball bearing fans this ball bearing fan are on a higher price because as per their costing of production expenses other and this sleeve bearing fans are little bit cheaper than ball bearing because they are having their limited co costing so these are the four points should be considered to buy fans or fan motors in your application as per your application so we had given our view on the fans or bearings which now it's upon you as per your requirement you can choose a good fan but consider those four points and you will be getting a good product as per your requirement so thank you for watching our video if you like it share with your friends also subscribe to our channel thank you